Today we are at Walmart checking out their back to school items. Let's see what kind of deals we can pick up for back to school. As soon as we walk in the store, they have these bins in the aisles. And the first one we see here is the 88 cent bins. And these have some pencils, some erasers. And then the next one is the $1.97 bin. Let's see what we can buy for $1.97. Actually, this was a good deal for the Stadler 10-pack uh, of pencil crayons. Um, Stadler's a really good brand, so that's actually a really good deal. Some glue sticks and a package of highlighters. Those always come in handy. Some more glue sticks. And now the 247 bins. And we have some whiteout from Bic. Those ones are really handy. And then the liquid one. I don't know how many people use the liquid one anymore. And then of course, Paper Mate has their version of it as well. I like those tape ones. And then we have, oh, a clicky pen. I love those. I used to use those all the time when I was a kid. Love those. And actually they write really nice too. And then the 397 bins. And they had these uh, Crayola washable water watercolor paints. I thought that was a great deal. Uh, pencil sharpener, eh, not so great of a deal. And just a set of pens as well. Some more pens, black pens, blue pens. And oh, and they had these little math sets. So that was actually kind of a good deal for that price. And then we had some scissors. It looks like this bin or these bins were all full of just different colored scissors. And then Bic had their own little bin set up too in the aisle there with all their different mechanical pencils and pens. And then off to the Crayola area. Tons and tons of Crayola. These are cool. These are erasable pencil crayons. How cool is that? Love the design on them too. Very cool. $6.77 though. Ouch. This was a great deal. $1.97 for a 64 pack of crayons. And then they also had their washable markers, the thin pointed ones. So those were $4.97. And then they had their 50 pack of pencil crayons on sale for $4.97. And this was actually really cool. It was a Stadler 72 pack of pencil crayons and it was in like a tin. So that was actually really, really cool. But $12.97, ouch. <laughs> really cool though. And then just some more markers. So we've got the super tip ones for $1.97. And then some of their twisty pencil crayons. I love those. Those are so, so cool. Love those ones. 24 pack. $9.97 though. Ugh. Some of this stuff is so expensive. And then they had their little ones there, their squeaks markers. And they were $4.97. And then I like this super pack of the felts. And those were $50 for the super fine tip for $8.97. And then my favorite, Mr. Sketch. I love Mr. Sketch, but they've always been so, so pricey. $8 for a package of Mr. Sketch. Oh, but I love those. I love, love, love. And then they had some clear glue, which I've never seen that before. It's been a long time since I've seen clear glue, since elementary school. It was that yellow. I don't know if you, <laughs> probably dating myself, but um, we used to have in elementary, like grade one, grade two, we used to have to get the invisible glue and it was the yellow stuff with a little rubber tip. <laughs> there was a good deal for the um, the glue sticks. A big bottle of glue for $9.97. And then let's go around the corner and see what they have. Oh, just some more Crayola set up there. Some of their markers. And then around the corner again. And we had these cool pens for $4.97. It was Stranger Things. Different pens. I think it was a two pack there. And then they had Harry Potter, yeah, two pack, Harry Potter, um, another one there. That was just a single pen though, Harry Potter pen. And then pencil cases. So we had some different ones. Oh, those were cute little, little kittens on the front. And then just ones with different designs, different colors. And then I found this one, which was really kind of weird. That was actually a pencil case, believe it or not. <laughs> 
yeah, it was, uh, I'm not even sure, a whale, I guess, is what it's supposed to be. I don't know. That one was really pretty with the flowers on it. And some pink ones and black ones and all sorts of different colored ones. And then, of course, their duotangs were a great deal, 10 cents. Just some more erasers and some more highlighters for $3.47. And then a pack of Papermate, different colored fine tip pens. Those are kind of pricey though, 11 bucks. Ooh. And then what else can we find here? Oh, and here we go, the best deal. <laughs> 97 cents for a package of pencils. And I think sometimes actually for back to school, Staples has a really good deal on pencils. It's usually like 10 cents or something like that for a package of pencils. And then off to some of the notebooks that they had. Some super, super cool designs on the front. I really like them. Very, very cool. Love those. There's some with glitter too. Very, very cool. $2.97 for those. And then just some plain ones in different colors. And then just your regular ones as well for $1.97. Just the coil notebooks. And then some down here. These were actually really cool. They were like neon colors. So they had like neon orange, neon pink, neon green. So those were actually quite pretty. And then just your regular duotangs, or not duotangs. Uh, yeah, I guess they would be duotangs notebooks there. Scribblers, that's the word I'm looking for. And then just some more folders that kind of match those coiled notebooks. And then some new day timers. They were really, really pretty. They had some nice ones. There's a nice flowered one. I love this one with the unicorn on the front. I might have to, might have to pick that one up. I love that. And then just some more notebooks. And then of course, backpacks. You can't forget the backpack for back to school. Probably one of the most important things. <laughs> And they had tons and tons of different styles for everybody. They had this cool Spider-Man one with a lunch bag attached to it. And some different ones there. And then they had, uh, yeah, just different colors. This one was cool. It was clear with some sparkles in it. I thought that was kind of cool. And just some different Jurassic Park. Oh, this one was cool. I love this one, this marble one. Very, very cool. And then of course, <laughs> they had no shortage of frozen lunch boxes there. And then just some more different colored duotangs and folders for 97 cents. And then the expensive binders, the five star ones for $19. Very, very pricey. They're nice binders, but ugh, ouch. They've always been so, so pricey. Around the 18 to $20 mark, but nice, nice binders, but very pricey. And of course, they all came in different colors as well. Handy. And then just some more regular binders in different colors. Lunch kits. It's a nice one there. And that one actually was a seven piece. That was actually really cool. There's different varieties there. I thought that was pretty cool. And some thermoses. And then more bins. They had an 88 cent bin. Look at all the highlighters you can get for 88 cents each. <laughs> and I think there was uh, tape there as well, I believe. And just some more pens as well. Oh, and then some post-it notes. Gotta have some post-it notes. Very important. <laughs> and some Sharpie pens. There's a pack for $2.97. A pack of black ones. Those ones always come in handy as well. And for $5.97, you can get a whole set of Sharpies in different colors. I believe those are the fine tipped ones. Those come in handy sometimes too. And a package of highlighters as well by Sharpie. And so thin ones, thick ones, whichever ones you prefer. And I think that was the same pack. And then, yeah, that's the same ones I do believe. And then you can also, for $5.97, you can get yourself a brand new calculator. That's obviously just a regular, regular calculator. And just some more mechanical pencils, a big huge pack, 24. And then I found some more of these expensive binders <laughs> down another aisle. And they had all different types of colors and sizes, different ones there. I think these were the cheap, cheapy ones <laughs> for 14, $15. Those were kind of like the Walmart brand ones. 
And then just your regular binders as well. I think those are a little bit cheaper. So about the $5 range for those ones. And those ones are the one inch, two inch, whatever size. That one was pretty with the flowers. Very nice. And then just some more folders. And yeah, just some folders there and some more duotangs. And oh, dividers. That was one thing I couldn't find in the aisles there and I finally found them. Those were super, super pretty. If you need dividers, those are very nice instead of just the plain ones. And then they had those ones as well, the colored ones. So very nice. Some more booklets there, notebooks. Very, very pretty. Those were hard covered ones. And then they had some more soft cover ones. That one was really pretty too. Lots of variety. Very, very nice. More little notebooks. Very nice. Okay, so we are out of Walmart right now. I hope you enjoyed checking out some back to school items. And actually the only thing I picked up was this clicky pen, the one with the four different colors. I love these when I was younger. It's been a long time since I had one of these and I like that it's like a shiny pink color. So I had to buy it. And that's all actually that I picked up. So I hope you enjoyed that. It gave you some back to school ideas. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to check out some of my other videos with shopping, thrifting, Dollar Tree, Dollar Store. I also have a uh, Dollar Tree back to school video. So make sure you check that out before you head back to school. And that's about it for today. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for joining me and we'll see you all next time. Oh, this guy got his Roomba.